I also really love Kansas beating Duke 35-27, moved to 4-0. and Okay. I am taking a quiet joy in Lance Leipold and the Kansas Jayhawks moving to 4-0 and for the first time since 2009. Taking a quiet joy in Jalen Daniels absolutely being a dude. 19 of 23, 324 yards, four touchdowns, no interceptions, 11 rushes, 83 yards. Rank Kansas, you cowards! Now, the thing for you to take away from this is not just the Kansas sold out its stadium, 47,000 it holds. I made the quip on the Twitters that Kansas sold out a game in 2022 before USC did, to which people said USC has a 77,000 seat coliseum, to which I say, explain Oklahoma to me now, who has 85,000, 3 million people living in the state, half of them claiming to be Oklahoma State fans. Then explain Nebraska to me, which also seats more than 80,000 people and hasn't been good in over a decade, okay? If you love football, you love football. And Kansas is a football school. The part for you to really, really hammer in to anybody who wants to talk about this, though, is that Lance Leipold has never once acted like this is a fluke or how he's happy to be here. Every step of the way, Lance Leipold has said, no, it's nice. It's, it's a nice win. You know, it's nice that we got to show a little heart today. That's the confidence that you can have in your program when you have won six national championships. Hello? Hello? Look, there's a reason why I like Lance Leipold hired. It's one, Travis Goff and Lance Leipold have a great relationship. And two, Lance has won everywhere he's gone. Why wouldn't he not win at Kansas? It took him less than a year to flip that program. And now everybody is on notice. Kansas, Kansas State, Baylor, Texas Tech. These, Oklahoma State, I know this week, these are the bastions of Big 12 football right now. Thank you for watching the number one college football show. Please remember to subscribe to the channel and like this video so that you don't miss any of the best college football coverage in America.